If you are new here, hi, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando and I make all shop with me videos, home decor videos at like Target, Home Goods, Walmart, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, World Market, Kirkland, any store that sells home decor or anything to do with the home, just pretty much anywhere where you can like spend your money, that's where I like to film. So if you love home decor videos or shopping videos, you're definitely gonna love it here. So please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps my channel. And make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. And if you wanna be notified every single time I post a video, which is four times a week on Monday, Tuesday, Friday, and Saturday, you can go ahead and hit the notification bell right next to the subscribe button. I did already address this, but yes, my voice is like super coarse. I don't really know what's going on with it. It's just a little bit dry, I guess. It's so, so hot here in Florida. And also I do talk a lot for my job, so kind of makes sense. My voice is kind of just struggling right now, but that's not gonna stop me. Today's video is a home goods shop with me. You guys have been loving my home goods videos lately. They have tons of fall and Halloween decor out in Florida already. So I'm so sorry if you haven't been able to find it in your area, but I hope that my videos have given you a great idea of what you can find near you when your store finally does stock the decor. So today's video, like I said, is gonna be a home goods shop with me. We're gonna shop all around the store. I'll try to hit all the different areas and show you what they have that is new. Of course, I will show you any fall or Halloween or Thanksgiving decor that we find in the store. And we're just gonna kind of shop around and see what is new this week at Home Goods. So if you wanna see what's new at Home Goods right now, what you could potentially find at a store near you, just keep watching because we're gonna head into Home Goods right now. Okay, they have this sign right here, and I wanted to point this out in case you guys haven't heard about this. It's this little show that they're doing on YouTube where she like moves into Home Goods and lives there, and I've been obsessed with it, so I wanted to show it to you guys in case you haven't heard of it. Just go on YouTube and search Home Sweet Home Goods. I'll try to remember to link it down below for you guys. It is seriously so funny. Right when you walk in, they have this like beautiful setup for the new like India and Morocco collection. So many pretty things. Like this piece of furniture instantly caught my eye, as well as this like fake palm tree situation that they have going on. But they just have so many pretty like home accents, furniture pieces, and different items for this collection. Like, is this not the prettiest picture frame you've ever seen? Like, everything is just so pretty. And then this green vase I really like as well. This one's actually made in Turkey, and this one is $30. I love this chest. It's actually like open, so there's no like glass or anything. It just has like two doors. It's a great size. It is actually on clearance for 460. They say it is as is, so typically that means there's something wrong with it. It's not like closing all the way properly. I think you could like sand it down though and easily fix that. But this is gorgeous, like beautifully carved piece of furniture. I was just kind of like playing with the doors and I honestly feel like it's like a classic case of like wood swelling because it's so hot and humid here in Florida. So I don't know, I feel like that's the problem. Look at this giant dog. It kind of looks like a Great Dane mixed with like a Dalmatian. I love it, it is $200. I'm at a home goods that I don't shop at very often. It's typically a home goods that I actually don't like because it's really small, but it's actually packed with a bunch of awesome new stuff, so I'm really excited. They have these two accent chairs here, perfect like coppery rust color for the fall, and they are $3.99. I'm actually gonna do the sit test because it looks really comfy, so I wanna put it to the test. <sighs> it's actually also a swivel chair. I'm a big fan. I wish the back came up higher because I feel like even if you scooch down and put an ottoman in front of it, it like wouldn't be very supportive of your neck, but it's really soft material and it's actually pretty comfy. They have this like big pineapple for $40 that is white. I actually really like it. I think that is so cool. It is part of their Vietnam collection and it's just like a woven big decorative pineapple. There's also a bunch of like furniture clearance maybe just to make room for like new items. Like this couch is on clearance for 1200. This entertainment stand is also on clearance. This one is 350. They all say as is, but honestly they look perfect. And then like side tables, bar stools, big mirrors. There are tons of clearance furniture items right now. The fall items are definitely starting to trickle in the entire store. Like this is nowhere near the other fall items, but they just 
but they have put it on this end cap with like some black candles and like other accents that would work really well for the fall but look at these like big black pumpkins this one is $34.99 and it does have a place for like a bunch of candles at the bottom and then they have this like smaller more traditional pumpkin and this one is 30. Oh my gosh they have amazing baskets right now for a basket wall these ones in particular caught my eye they're really different than anything else i have seen here like the woven style and the patterns and stuff i really really like this one i feel like this one would be a good accent to my basket wall that i have been planning for like a year this one is 50 dollars, so definitely a bit on the pricier side same with this one and then they do have these ones that are like more of like a bigger woven style and this is even bigger than this one but this one's only 30 dollars, so definitely the difference in like the style of the wovenness and these ones just seem very very nice okay now we're gonna chat about what i feel like most of you are here for and that is the fall and halloween decor that they have in store i have already shown a lot so i'm gonna try to only show you things i haven't shown before or just anything new that catches my eye because we have a long time until halloween so i definitely want to make sure i'm not like repeating the same items over and over again but if you missed any of my other fall and halloween home goods videos i'll definitely make sure to link them down below so you can get all caught up so of course many many glass pumpkins and all sorts of sheens and sizes and a lot of them do light up this one sticks out to me a lot. I have not seen one this color this beautiful beautiful green color Haven't seen one like that yet. So I wanted to make sure to point this one out to you This one is $14.99 and it does light up and it also has this like really pretty like leafy pattern on it This one is really interesting even more pumpkins. This one is like totally catching my eye It is such a pretty like bright peach color, but it's also iridescent it has a silver stem This one does not light up and it is $12.99 I love this yellow one as well. I have not seen any that are like these fun colors. This one is 17 and it does light up. It has a gold stem. Such a pretty like mustard color. This one is very tempting. Oh my god. Look at this skeleton mermaid. That is so cool. I haven't seen anything like this yet. And it's $14.99. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with everything on this end cap. Look at this stunning yellow velvet pumpkin with this like gold glittery top for $16.99. I can't. I love this. I also really like this like coral colored one for $29.99. It has a fake tea light in it again, so this one lights up. A lot more pillows, and as the days goes on, they come in like more colors. So they have this like really nice green. I feel like this sage green color is gonna be really popular. They have it in like a heavily beaded version and then like a more lightly beaded version. This one is so nice if you do like tons of neutrals it's a great mix of like grays and then like taupes i really like this one then if you have like more colors or if you like things more colorful they do have those options as well i love these ones with like witches and like dancing cats and i love the little like brooms this one's just black on the back and it does have a removable cover so that is super nice definitely like lots of options for black cats i love how this one also has like a crow and the three pumpkins and spider webs there's just tons of really fun details on here and this pillow is like a little bit sparkly so that's definitely different and this one is twenty dollars if you like more like fall farmhouse they do have these gingham pillows with pumpkins they have it in gray as well as in black and these are $20 as well and super soft. They do have fun little Ray Dunn signs like Hocus Pocus, I need wine to focus. Just a little box sign and this is 10. Then they also have that one that says which way to the wine. I probably have a better chance of like actually meeting Jesus himself in Home Goods than finding a single piece of Ray Dunn Halloween like ceramic pottery, even like a mug, nothing. That stuff is so popular. Of course, if I find it, I will show it to you. And my friend and Megan is looking for it so I'm always on the hunt for it I just look casually when I'm at the stores but yeah I definitely think I have a better chance of meeting Jesus than finding any of it in the store Ray Dunn Halloween is by far the most competitive like people search like hunted down like cats and dogs viciously because they're just obsessed with it I'm a, I like the Christmas stuff I have tons of Christmas Ray Dunn I always love the Christmas Ray Dunn it's like the only Ray Dunn that I still like keep out on display because I just love it but I don't think I have any chance at all of finding any of the Halloween stuff to show you though. They do have a bunch of cute like pumpkin and fall plates. Look how adorable these are, these little pumpkin plates. And they're just like speckled with the leaves. I really like the glazing on them. The smaller plates are $3.99. I also really like how they're not like 
a perfect shape. They're all like a little bit shaped different. The full size versions are $4.99 a piece. And then they also have these little canisters that are Charlie Brown themed. So this one that has Snoopy that says it's fall y'all gather together and then this one that says cozy autumn in red and they have a bunch of these canisters 9.99 for the middle sized one $20 for that one and then 9.99 for the smallest sized one so a little pricey in my opinion there's also these Ray Dunn fall trays happy fall happy fall I guess they all say happy fall they also have these Charlie Brown themed mugs that say like be thankful with different peanut characters on them. This little cutting board is perfect for all year round, but especially for like Thanksgiving time and fall for $4.99. For $19.99, they have this really cool pumpkin dish that has like a spider on top. This is so cool. You could put like candy in here or tea lights. They also have this black cat one as well. That is so cool. Ooh! More of those napkin rings we were seeing, but owls. Owls and sunflowers are really popular this year. These pumpkin ones are really, really nice as well. Same Tahari brand as we saw before, for, for $12.99. And then they also come in these bats. I feel like a lot of you guys are gonna love these. These are so cool. They do also have several of these colorful skeleton canisters. So the canister one that closes is $4.99, which is a good deal. And then they just have this other little skull head for $3.99. This is so cool this bowl right here with the little skull hands all over it the bowl is really really pretty as well this would be the coolest candy dish they just added these really cool two-tiered trays they are almost like little bowls inside so you could use it for like a fruit dish but you could also use it for like potpourri or candy or you could get creative and do like something more spooky like if you're having a halloween party i've seen people do like um, you use a straw with jello to make like worms or whatever so you could do that in here This is really cool. This little like hap this little happy Halloween two-tiered tray It does have a bunch of like spider web accents. I really like this and this is $30 They do have some fall towels finally trickling into the store, which I love They are all so cute. I love how like subtle some of them are so like this one just has like the bats they have a similar one in pumpkins, which is just so cute. They have black cats. With each of these, you're gonna get one that's darker and then one that is the same, but in like a lighter version. So like light gray, dark gray, dark orange, light orange, and you get two towels for $6. And these are really good quality. I love this brand. They are like really soft, but also absorbent and just really nice quality kitchen towels. They also have an acorn version. So they have like the dark beige and then the more like light colored beige. They do also have like more cutesy ones. So if you're into the cutesy ones, they do have these like witch ones with dangling legs. This pumpkin one that also has the dangling legs. This really adorable ghost that also has the dangling legs and then like that's the other towel it comes with this one that says boo so they just have like tons of options this pumpkin they seriously have so many oh that pillow i really like they have it in a towel version but these are like purely decorative like if you dry your dishes like you know if you hand wash and then dry like you could not use this type of towel you would definitely want this type they also have really pretty ones that have like embroidery on them i really like it and then this one comes with like just a nice silver stripe towel this one could definitely be used all year round and they do have more colorful fall options if that is more your jam i found these ones that i really like it's a perfect mix of like green and orange it is two of the same towel for 6.99 if you're looking for more farmhouse fall for 7.99 they have have this towel with like an orange truck pumpkins and some gingham then the second towel is just all gingham they do have this like subtle pumpkin one they have ones with like sunflowers there's just endless options they do also have some really pretty like fall napkins already these ones that have pumpkins you do get 12 napkins in this pack for ten dollars they also have really pretty napkin rings like look at these like beautiful gemmed out leaves these are 12.99 these are absolutely gorgeous they also have a tablecloth that matches those napkins that is so nice that they have just a few options so far for fall tablecloths and these range from 13 to 20 dollars look at these like beautifully beaded table runners this one is like a haunted house scene but it is literally fully beaded and then they also have that in a skull version like look at the detailing on that these i almost missed they at my store are down on the bottom of all the tablecloths 
They of course have a lot of really adorable stuff by the checkout. These caught my eye immediately. These coaster sets, they are fully beaded. You get four coasters for $5.99. So they have this little sunflower one. They have this more neutral one, just a pumpkin. They have this like more colorful but still super subtle pumpkin one. And then this really pretty orange pumpkin one. I think I need these. For $10, they have this witch gnome. This one is super funny with the gray hair, striped and the nose and the hat. They also have this gnome with a very fancy mustache. They have this pumpkin soap dispenser, chilling mint ghost goo hand wash, just in a little like blue pumpkin. I'm wondering though if the soap is blue, like if you took the blue soap out, could you put like orange soap? Not really sure about the blue. They have a bunch of felt pumpkins. We have seen a lot of these. Haven't seen this white one though. This one is $7.99. They have these kitchen towels, which is like gingham, but like it's a ghost instead of a square with these really cute jack-o'-lantern faces at the bottom. With this set, you get the two towels for $6.99. They have like a swirly tie-dye pumpkin back there with a gold stem. That is really nice. I haven't seen a pumpkin like that before. They also have these little like hay figures. This one kind of looks like a moose. They also have this one, which I think is a pig, and these are $4.99. And then just a bunch more of the little felt items and more coasters, which I just am obsessed with these. These are so nice. I also really like this carved pumpkin, this carved wooden pumpkin for $4.99. I just love how neutral it is. They also have a variety of Ray Dunn pillows over here. Pumpkin everything, happy Halloween, believe in magic, just a bunch. And these are $12.99. Some of them are super, super soft. And then some of them kind of feel like outdoor pillows. Okay, whoa, look at what else they have in the checkout. They have this huge, 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 huge water jug. This must be like at least a gallon. This thing is massive. It's basically the giant version of my water bottle. Like the size difference, it just doesn't even compare. Oh my gosh. Plus this one has like a straw. I kind of want it. It does have this really cool handle. It is $24.99. I wish it was like more insulated or like had um, like a sleeve around it, like some of the ones you see on Amazon. So I think I'm gonna shop around for something like this on Amazon. Alrighty, you guys. Well, that is gonna be it for me today. I really hope that you enjoyed seeing everything they had that is new at Home Goods. I just can't get over how much like fall and Halloween decor there already is. Brian has to keep reminding me that it's literally like still the summer. So he's trying to like bring me back down to earth, but I'm like, Fall, Halloween, Christmas, Thanksgiving. Like, I'm so ready for the end of the year. Just because I'm so excited for the holidays. I just love the holidays. They're my favorite time of the entire year. And this year, we're going to be, like, traveling to see family. And my mom's going to come for Christmas. And I'm just so excited. I don't understand how we just got so off topic. Shiny object syndrome. Anyways, today's questions with Katie question is coming from Jackie Medina. Love you, Jackie. You're like one of the first people that always comments on my videos and it does not go unnoticed. So I wanted to answer your question that says, how can you walk away whenever you go to clearance and there's a lot of cute stuff? Curious me, LOL. Honestly, that's a really good question. A lot of people are like, how do you not buy everything? And always have questions about like how I resist. Honestly, I just see so much home decor that like, at this point, I just know exactly what I'm looking for. So it's pretty easy for me to be like, no, I don't need that. I don't want it and kind of walk away from it. So I don't know. I don't really struggle with it that much. Sometimes I do find awesome stuff in the clearance section. And if it's awesome enough, I will buy it. But I don't like to have a ton of clutter. So that is how I like resist and don't buy stuff. I think I just am constantly looking at stuff. So I just am more like honed in on exactly what I am looking to buy. Thank you so much, Jackie, for your question. If you want to be featured in an upcoming questions with Katie video, please make sure to leave me a question down below. Everybody stop right now. Go leave me a question down below, please. And thank you. But thank you so much to Jackie for asking that question. But that is going to be it for me. I love you guys all so much. And I will see you next time. Bye, guys.